All right, loves. Um, this is my Mercury Lounge vlog. What the fuck is happening right now? I'm performing there a second time. Like, what the fuck? This is actually happening? Um, so I just got back from getting my nails done for the show. Um, I have rehearsals in a little bit, the final rehearsal, but I just picked up my business cards. Um, the final thing I've been waiting for, for the show, for tomorrow, and I want to do a reaction because I don't like, I designed it on Canva and everything, but I've never like done business cards before and it's like, I don't know like how they came out. So we're gonna do a live reaction to it. I hope it came out well, or at least like not blurry, but we're gonna... Oh stop, this is so cute. Wait, I really like this. So this is the front, right? And then we got the back. The only thing is I wish the white was in here, but like it didn't come out blurry. I was like nervous because online it looked blurry. I know the picture of me isn't as, where is it? Isn't as clear, but like this side is. So I was worried that this was gonna be blurry, but I have my little logo and just, you know, to have at um, the merch table, or just in general, I feel like I should start carrying these around because um, I've been networking a lot more lately and I feel like these are necessary. I don't know if I'll get new ones in the future. Oh, it has the white on top here too. Okay, that makes me feel better. It looks cooler, okay. But they didn't come out blurry. I'm really excited. These are so cute. I really like the back. I almost didn't do anything for the back. I'm kind of glad I did. Um, Cause this is also the photo from Ticketmaster. All right guys, this is like happening. What the fuck is going on? guys we are back at it with another makeup look ignore my hair not finished but we will take a better angle of my makeup later of course but i had to give a shout out to my girl again because she kills it every fucking time and i couldn't not do mercury without her makeup like especially after that show and your <laughs> the your makeup look being in my photo for ticket now so yeah. yeah we love that yeah. Alrighty, you should follow her guys all right in the green room. I haven't been here since 2019. This is fucking insane. I can't. I'm so excited, guys. I, this is my biggest moment in music right now. This is my biggest moment. So authentic, if I lied to you, I'd be synthetic. I mean, there's no way that I could misplace all the feelings that I'm feeling stuck on replay. But how do I tell you how I really feel? Cause I'm tripping over you. Surreal. All you do is cross my mind and I can't even sleep The sound of your voice is just stuck on repeat I think there's something special and I'm making it clear I can't move too fast, I'm stuck on first gear I'm feeling so confused, got me so dumb All these thoughts in my head make me wanna run Dealing with these issues, it ain't no fun This heartbreak has me so Humiliation, humiliation 
I've gotten a lot of opportunities because I performed here as my first headlining show and it's been so much fun. I've also experimented a lot with music since then and I kind of recently went back to my country roots. So uh, do you guys mind if I do some country? Woo! Let's go! Wait one second, this is <laughs>
If y'all don't know, I am a Taylor Swift fan. Um, we're not at the part of the show where I sing Taylor yet, don't worry. You have time. Um, but I went to Nashville when I was 16 because I wanted to see where she started out. And so I went to Bluebird Cafe. I was there maybe six hours in Nashville. And while we were at Bluebird, we were just there to go to dinner and everything. And the guy performing stopped his show and was like, if anybody want to come on stage, sing a song, I want to get time out of my set to do that. And I took advantage of that opportunity. I was awful, but that's a different story. <laughs> but 16 year old me can be like, I performed at Bluebird Cafe. That was my big moment. That was my first performance. And so if a stranger could do that for me, of course I'm gonna do it for the people I care about. So I have a friend here tonight that is having his debut performance as a country artist. Y'all get a round of opportunity! What's up, y'all? This is my new song called Polaroids. Now I'm feeling overjoyed, looking through these blurry Polaroids. Take me on a journey, mm, now they destroy me. Pictures never lie, they paint a picture of my simple life. And memories in every shallow tour, I stole away in an old ground floor. called Set Me Free. It came out in 2019 and it has Nicole Young. don't play no games. You messing with the clowns, I'll give you better days. I could give you better days if you ask for them. I can't see J Latin in a dark star. We are full of endless possibilities. Get you out of my mind for good and finally I can say adios. Oh, 
Look at what you did to me. Now you're just a memory. And I can spend any more of my time just missing you. Look at how you damaged me. I don't need an apology. I just need to forget you and what you put me through. Yeah, we never stop. Hey, you know we never stop. Now count me down real quick like the ball's about to drop. Yeah, we proud of who we are. Yeah, we always feel like stars. I will turn up the light because the light is who we are. We always feel like stars, you can turn off the light. Let's go. Thank you guys for coming. We got one more chorus left in here. And I want you guys to sing this with me. All right? Give it up for Nicole. Give it up for Sarah. Could not have done this without them. Thank you guys so much. Cheers. Puppy juice. Cheers and cheers. I feel like I should have. Come on, man. Hold your breath and take it. Hold your breath and take it. Chase out the door. Oh, I thought it was Album out now. Guys, we did it! We performed at Mercury Lounge again. We did it. And guess who made his debut? It was so fun, guys. Also, I'm pretty sure this is the same hotel room as Moment's tour, because it's the 22nd floor. It's fine. I mean, we already, we, you already know, you already know, but it was so good. Um, one of my friends said to me after the show, and he's like somebody that like, I trust his word on everything, but he said it was my best show. And I don't know if he, like if it's true, but I appreciated how good the vibes were. Mercury Lounge posted me on their story. And of course it was during Taylor, which we love. Um, unintentionally performed You Belong With Me on the two year anniversary of Fearless Taylor's version. I hate myself, um, <laughs> but it went really, really well. And of course, I'm going to be posting so many videos from it, but yeah, uh, we did it. It's time to make things right. It's time.